So Leute, lasst uns mal kurz in den äh, Zimmerumbau von Matt Malone gucken. Das würde mich wirklich mal brennend interessieren, was da geändert wurde. Das sieht äh, erstmal auf den ersten Blick, lächelt uns ein sehr freundlicher Mensch mit einem unglaublich schönen Mustache an, den er da rockt. Das fand ich schon mal geil. Lass mal gucken, was da so los ist. Es sind viele, viele Sachen, die jetzt schon auf den ersten Blick da sind. Hi guys, hey, well, it's Matt Malone here. How are you? I stream iRacing. I wanted to do this video kind of like a documentation because I'm redoing this whole race room and I wanted to document some stuff. Now we've been in this house for almost two years already and I've never done like a race room, race rig tour video. I'm not really going to do one now, but uh, I just wanted to document some of this stuff. We'll go over real quick uh, the rig that I'm using and then the current state of this uh, racing room that I have here in the new house. And then I'm going to sh share with you what the plans are going forward uh, to totally remodel this room. Ich sehe mich gerade selber, weil ich glaube, dass Matt Malone ein Display hat und sich die ganze Zeit im Display selbst anguckt, aber nicht in die Kamera guckt. Deswegen finde ich schwen äh, schwenkbare Displays bei Kameras immer, ist bei der hier auch. Weil genau oben drüber ist, bin ich selber, jetzt gucke ich dahin und jetzt gucke ich euch an. Das ist immer super verwirrend. Ich finde das total interessant, dass andere Leute auch diese Probleme haben. Alright, so. This is the rig. It is a uh, combination of a couple of different uh, four-play racing rig rigs. And that's the number four, uh, four play racing rigs. Uh, I got, I had two of them over the years. I've kind of cannibalized them, kind of customized it all myself. But just real quick, I mean, it's a, it's a monitor stand with the rig. I have a DX racer chair. Had it for years and years. The problem that I'm having is that it's. It doesn't really sit square anymore because I get in and out of it so many times and I always get in and out of it on the left side. So over the years, it's like really like flexed and bent to the left. So I never feel like I'm sitting square to the wheelbase. So it's just kind of an issue. I'm going to be upgrading to a uh, next level racing uh, rig, the iRacing edition. So we got that ready to go. Um, but yeah, uh, just go over real quick because I've never... Stulsen, bist du noch da? Ja, okay. Äh, fällt dir was auf, was dich auch, was mich mittlerweile so auch schon sehr doll stört, was ich von dir gelernt habe, wenn du dir das hier so anguckst? Ich hoffe, wir verstehen uns gerade. Und du weißt, was ich meine? <lacht> da sind keine Kappen. Ja, scheiß Kappen sind nicht drauf. Ja, du, ich habe auch überall, seitdem du mit mir so doll gemeckert hast, hat sich das eingebrannt. Ich habe jetzt auch überall Kappen drauf done a race room tour here down here but uh i got the samsung 57 inch ultra wide monitor i got an additional 34 inch monitor as secondary i'm running ace attack the ace attack invicta bundle which is the 27 newton meter wheelbase with the two stage hydraulic brake and throttle combo and then that's my vrs clutch oh I'm not going to go over the computer specs. It's a 4090 with the latest Intel chip. That's about a year old now, that computer. Um, yeah, I'm still using das ist einfach, Das ist einfach so richtig Premium. Das habe ich früher auch gehabt und eigentlich ist das super clever. Oder man, das ist auch das Erste, sage ich euch gleich, was ich mache. Ich werde mir eine Halterung, wenn der 3D-Drucker da ist, werde ich mir eine Halterung entwickeln für meine, meine Tastatur, dass ich hier einfach in die Seite reinsliden kann. Weil das nimmt so viel Platz weg, wo du so viele schöne Sachen mitmachen könntest. Das ist das, was wird das Erste sein, was ich mit euch gemeinsam irgendwie entwickle, ausmesse und dann werden wir das 3D drucken und daran ballern. Ich habe einen Antlion Wireless Mod Mic und ich habe ein paar extra Rims, den Ace Attack F1 Style Rim und mein neuen MPI rim with a turn button plate and that all those all have um ace attack quick releases but this video isn't Ooh. really about the rig um it's really about what's going to happen here in the next uh, week or two with the racing room so this is my little cubby in the new house it uh <laughs> from here from this wall to this closet is 66 inches wide And then I get a little bit of a bump out here. I'm not sure exactly what the total width. I mean, it gives me like an extra two feet or so, I'd say. Ich finde das übrigens so krass, dass in Amerika alle schon Schränke in den Wänden drin haben. 
das ist einfach, die haben ja nur äh, hier äh, Rehgipswände, was ja, die knallen alles in die Wände rein. Das ist so geil, wenn du dir bei den Leuten das mal anguckst, die stechen oben einfach ein Loch rein, dann schmeißen die ihr Kabel rein, unten machen die so eine Kabelführung ran, dann machen die ein bisschen Gips dran, ne, malen den Scheiß über und dann haben die einfach die Kabel in der Wand gelegt. Die sind da so, da, da ist wirklich alles aus Pappe. Da ist alles aus Pappe, das ist halt echt crazy. Und überall Schränke drinne und super verwinkelte, verschnörkelte, fancy aussehende Decken, weil da einfach nur so ein Holzgestell dran ist, so ein Rehgips dran und dann wird das überstrichen, das ist einfach total fancy. Um, so this is what I'm working with. It's almost like a closet, but it's the race room, you know? It's all I need. So right now I got my computer over. I mean, this place is a mess. I mean, I just got done streaming today. I'm going to start ripping everything down this weekend. I'm going to stream everything live over on the Twitch channel. But uh, this is this is basically rough shape. I mean, this is basically how we're operating here. I'm not cleaning up. I mean, you want the real deal. This is it. I got stuff on the floor. I got some Christmas presents here. I've yet to wrap. Das finde ich übrigens immer sehr sympathisch. Das denke ich mir auch immer. Warum soll ich jetzt groß aufräumen? wenn ich so lebe. Man lebt halt so, wie man lebt. Das ist halt, wenn Gäste kommen, okay, ne, dass die Klos sauber sind, dass sie sich nicht auf irgendwie auf dein, deine Hämorrhoiden setzen, mal völlig übertrieben, aber der Rest, man lebt ja auch in der Wohnung. Ne? Also ich meine, solange dir jetzt nicht irgendwie eine äh, ne Spinne irgendwie auf den Kopf fällt oder sowas, äh, ne? also ihr, ihr wisst, was ich meine, dann ist das ja doch roman. Ich finde das cool. Ich finde das, also find das super sympathisch, wenn Leute das machen. One of Ellie's stools. Stuff everywhere, you know. That's just that's just the way it goes, you know. Um, so yeah, mm. this is the room, and I'm ready to redo it. So I'm getting new carpet. New carpet's coming. It's going to be a real hard Berber, like a strong, hard, flat office carpet. And we're going to go ahead and paint. Now I got some samples here. I'm going to go with this black for basically the walls and everything. And this is a uh, blue accent that I color matched the blue to the next level racing rig, the iRacing Edition. So this is the blue accents that the rig is going to have. So I'm going to have blue accent okay. uh, in and around the room. And I'm not 100% sure yet, but you see how like my ceiling fancy kind of has these different levels to it. So I wanted to do blue on the kind of the horizontal, like these edge outs. So like this would be blue, this would be blue. Same thing over there, that'd be blue, that'd be blue. And then like under here, it's gonna be white, white, white. And then the walls are gonna be that dark, it's not black, it's like charcoal or whatever. And that's gonna be there. And then along this wall, I'm gonna have these 3D sound panels. And that's gonna go along this. Der Raum ist so klein, braucht man da wirklich noch Soundpanels drin? Weil da so viel steht ja schon drin und der Teppich nimmt ja auch viel. Krass. Wall here. Not, not the whole wall. You know, it's gonna end kind of where this, the top of this paint is. And then I'm gonna have the um, Philips Hue light strips top and bottom to shine up and down. And that's gonna be kind of the background of the, uh, the webcam as we're streaming there. Just to give this wall something different. Uh, so hopefully that plays well. And then those, obviously the Philip Hue lights will be all hooked up to the internet and stuff. And hopefully we can get pretty creative with that. I know they'll interact with like notifications and stuff, but hopefully we can get to the point where... Ja, das fand ich früher auch immer ganz toll. Und dann hat das immer ganz oft nicht funktioniert. Und ich bin froh, dass ich es jetzt nicht mehr habe. You guys are messing with me during races and they're going off, you know? <laughs> Something like that. So basically those sound panels are going to span all the way to, you know, maybe right here where the desk is going to be. Um, and this is obviously where the rig is going to go. It's just a matter of how it's going to fit in there as far as an angle. I mean, I kind of like the way I've been sitting this rig up kind of at an angle in this cubby. Gives me good access to the back. I can mess with pedals, mess with connections to the computer. Mm, that's all strong. that good stuff. Um Yeah, super excited to be building this new next level racing rig. So we're gonna see how that goes, and then here's a better look at that wall where those sound panels are gonna go with the lights. Um, these blue lights are uh, Philips Hue lights as well, and those back lights are just uh, regular uh, lamps on a dimmer. But uh, and then back here is my little 
office area and I'll show you the desktop that I got but I got a custom desktop just the top and that's gonna it's perfectly f cut and fit to this space so what? I'm just gonna put in supports along each wall and then it's just gonna fit right on top of this oh that's be cool. totally clean no legs no nothing like that so it's gonna fit right in this space really nice I got a uh, wall mount for the, uh, this is the 49-inch oh, Samsung oh, oh. Uh, G9. Clean. Thanks, Quirk. And I'm going to get rid of that poster. The poster is just not going to work in this room with the colors uh, that it has. So uh, we'll f I'll f try to figure out something creative for that. I mean, you guys won't see that. It'll just be for me. But And then, yeah, I'm going to paint the closet. In, in here in the closet, there's like some water. There's a poop pipe that runs. My sanitary line runs right here. <laughs> Uh, and there's some main water and stuff there, but I do have some shelving in there, so I got to organize all that. But I'll paint the uh, the doors just regular black or whatever. So hopefully it looks okay. And then I have this little I have this little jet out of a wall here. Here I got Cork's face right there. <laughs> uh, so maybe I do that in blue as well. Maybe I get like a custom fit iRacing logo that goes there. I mean, this poster is almost the right size. I, I don't know. You know, stuff like that, kind of finishing touches. But uh, basically, uh, yeah. So basically, what I, I'm going to be streaming this all on Twitch as well, starting next week, first week of December, and uh, during week 13. And so come say hi. I'm going to be uh, literally watching paint dry. But basically, I have to get everything out of this room and I have to get it all painted before the guys come and install the carpet on December 8th on a Friday. So I have all week to do it. So I think I'll be fine. Du, mit Andy und Stuhlsen machst das einen halben Tag, du. <lacht> Ist halt wirklich so. But I got a lot of uh, organizing to do. Taking all this stuff out. And then I have to stage it all over here which is this place is a mess so i got to clean up all this first get it all ready to be able to receive all this stuff um and here's the rig back over here in boxes i got boxes over there boxes here es sieht halt original aus wie bei mir als ich das gemacht habe ich hatte so viele pakete wir haben zwei caddy ladungen nur pappe weggefahren da ist also ehrlich gesagt ist das noch human Here's the uh, rig. I um I took just a little piece of it out. I had to open it up to get a little piece out so I could color match this blue. And that's the accent color that I was able to get at uh, Menards. Here's another shot of the uh, 3D sound panel I'm going to be using. Um, oh, and here's that uh, desktop that I got. It's just a nice desktop. I mean, it's like like really pro, like high-end like office furniture um so with a couple of nice nice grommets this is cool. put the cords in and I, me I measured it it's exactly the way i uh, i told them so it should fit in there perfectly so uh yeah lots of work to do but this whole area is going to be full and then another project this winter is uh this whole room is we're going to turn it into a library for uh for the house because Samantha loves to read. So Ooh. we're gonna have a nice little, try to get some like built-in uh, built uh, bookshelves, get this desk out of here, you know. It's gonna be a nice little sitting room, a little reading area, maybe one of those like electrical fireplaces and stuff. Just make the space real cozy, you sure. know. Just make it real cozy. Uh, now behind that closet is the sump pump. Oh, that's some good stuff over there. Maybe we'll make a whole separate video on that. That's some good stuff. But uh, yeah, I'm ready. So uh, basically. Ja, du, also die Library, die, also Lesezimmer direkt neben dem Stream kommt gut. Ich glaube, da macht Lesen richtig Spaß dann. <laughs> Just got to do it. So the first thing I have to do first, obviously, I'm going to get this computer out of here, set it up over here. And then that, that way I can stream this whole situation. So I'll set up the computer over here. And then I got really long USB cords for the uh, cameras. Das, you know, die Bauform von dem Haus ist auch sehr kurios, oder? Set them up on tripods and stuff so I can be moving stuff around. Show you guys. Um, but, uh, yeah. So, super excited. So come join the uh, Twitch live streams to watch me struggle. It's going to be a major struggle bus. 
It's going to be made of DUI situations here. So you can watch me lose Allen wrenches and uh, probably be drinking some paint. So uh, come on over. It's going to be fun. And you can give me some tips. But, uh, oh, das hätte ich jetzt persönlich nicht gesagt, dass äh, Leute in Chat kommen sollen, um mir Tipps zu geben. Of, uh, watching paint dry, so come check it out. Hey, it's winter. I'm laid off. I gotta do something. And this is gonna be super excited. It's gonna be a uh, race room uh, Alpha 2.0 here with the upgrade. So come check it out and uh, we'll see you then. All right, bye. Tschö. Okay, da bin ich gespannt. Gab's da noch mal ein Update-Video zu? Zufällig? Bei Matt Malone? Nee, schade. Da bin ich ja mal gespannt, weil, ob wir da noch mal ein Folgevideo zu kriegen. Das sieht ja wirklich sehr interessant aus. Vor allen Dingen, weil der Raum halt auch so verschachtelt ist. Das ist äh, also bin ich wirklich sehr gespannt, wie das am Ende äh, aussehen wird. Ich kann mir vorstellen, das wird ziemlich geil. 